Hi guys, welcome back to the Tech Chap. Now over the past few years, Apple iOS and Google Android have competed for the most apps on their stores, the most downloads, and the biggest mobile market share. But Windows phones have always been in a distant third place. I actually worked as a Microsoft student ambassador while I was at university a few years ago marketing Windows 8 products like laptops and also the Nokia Lumia 920 phone to students. The main problem I faced were people saying, wow, that's cool, I really like that, but can I get this app or this app on it? And all too often I'd have to say, no, not yet. The apps, or more specifically the lack of apps, is the main reason most of us haven't really given Windows phones a chance. So fast forward back to today, we've got new phones, we've got new hardware, these Lumia 950s have quad HD displays, multi-core processors, 20 megapixel cameras, and run the latest Windows 10 operating system. But what about the App Store? According to Statista.com, as of July 2015, there are 340,000 apps on the Windows Phone Store. That compares to 1.6 and 1.5 million on the Google Play and Apple App Stores respectively. That's quite a difference. So in this video, I want to find out while it may not have the same quantity of apps, whether Windows Phone has has the core social media, entertainment, and gaming apps that most of us use every single day. So from browsing the most popular apps on iOS and Android stores, I've created a top 20 app chart. I want to see how many I can get on my Windows phone. So it appears that only about 12 of my 20 apps are actually available on the Windows Store at the moment. It's great to see must-have apps like Facebook, Twitter, Spotify, Netflix, and Dropbox are all present and correct. However, there's still no proper YouTube app, simply an app that takes you to the mobile version of the website, which is a fair bit slower than the Android and iOS versions. Instagram's still in beta for some reason. We have the Amazon Kindle app, but no Prime, We've got no Google Maps, no Chrome browser, and all too often there's just simply no official app, so we have to make do with a third-party one, such as for BBC News and Imga, and neither are very good. But regardless of whether an app store has hundreds of thousands or millions of apps, it's the absence of any of these core, really fundamental apps that could be a deal-breaker if you rely on it every day. Day. So even though the hardware is better, the phones are faster, the displays are sharp, and the cameras are crisper, the Windows App Store still falls way behind the App Store from Apple and the Google Play Store. I love the live tiles home screen, it's so much better than anything else out there, I really like to have it on iOS or Android. And the camera on the Lumia 950 is fantastic, it's one of the best I've ever used. But despite all this, 
I couldn't switch to a Windows Phone because of the apps. There's still a fundamental lack of quantity and all too often quality bar a few standouts like Spotify. So if you're an Android or iOS user looking at these shiny new Windows phones like the Lumia 950, 950 XL or the Acer Jade Primo for example, but unsure about the app situation, I hope this video has helped you make up your mind one way or another. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching guys and I'll catch you again on the Tech Chat.